of the biggest names in the global game going head to head. Football matches barely come any more mouth-watering than the Derby d'Italia. It is a fixture that has seen so many great moments over the years. Great goals, great players. And every time Derby Day comes around again, it feels like the first time. And fans expect something special. It asks an awful lot, of course, for the players to perform amid such a big atmosphere. But these are amongst the world's biggest stars. And it is for days like this that they invest so much in their careers. It is feverish ahead of kickoff. Nothing, of course, is certain. The fans have been going at it full tilt for hours now, turning the stadium into a real bear pit. The moment comes, though, when fans turn their attention only to the players and players to the task ahead. These are the days when legends are made. It is a venue, this, which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. Well, it's a friendly in theory, but we are expecting this to be fiercely contested. Well, exhibition match sounds like an easy ozy game of football, Peter, and a picture-perfect occasion until the word pride gets a mention. And it's likely to have quite a big say between teams that could easily be sucked into an excuse for another feud. Why let an exhibition match get in the way of that? So these two will be going at it very, very strongly. So it's away we go then. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Yeah, Aidan Dzeko. He's a real handful up front, Peter, and not just because of his height and that physical presence. He's got excellent awareness. He's been bundled over. That is a foul. <laughs> Alexandro gets his final warning. Well, he knew what he was taking on there, Peter, and special... Massive leap! Good delivery, but no joy. Well, plenty of moving targets to pick out in the box. Obviously increases your chances of the ball being met like that by someone. Well positioned to make that interception. Chalhanolu. Brozovic. Martinez really was well marshalled there because he was denied the... Oh, shooting chance! Oh, that's a foul in a dangerous area. And the ref's been lenient here. And I doubt he'll get too many more chances. He's gone for the shots. Oh, that's just stunning. And this is already looking rather ominous for the opposition now when a player of his calibre can open up the scoring so fantastically. It could be a very long match for that defence to prevent a recurrence. And he's produced a beauty. Juventus trail at this early stage. How will they respond? Martinez gets it out to the wing. Bernadeschi. Trying to play it through. Oh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. Played out to the right. Well, there's a lot of movement out wide now. Yeah, you can certainly see that. 
Well, I think it's a move to open the game up more, whether out wide or, or just getting a runner through the middle now. Dybala has a go! And in it goes! They have done it! They have their equaliser! I can give the keeper a little sympathy here because I think he might have been slightly unsighted. However, credit where it's due, it's still a fine finish from a tight spot. Juventus grab the equaliser and we're all square. Oh, I think the coach will really be annoyed with that. The players were still thinking about their goal and just got caught napping. Martinez. Alexandro battles to win it back. Bernardeschi. And it's Locatelli. And the finish! Goal! Juventus! They've done it! It was coming! They have their reward! Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. That was all very well drilled. So we have a breakthrough, now how will things develop from here? No doubt as to who has the momentum here now, the only doubt is how many is coming. Good challenge, he just stood firm, nicely measured pass. He's had a go! Oh, taken with style! All too easy, they are in danger of disappearing out of sight. Swift, incisive, deadly. All done in a matter of seconds. That's just brilliant counter-attacking football, and as soon as possession was theirs, it triggered a move of devastating speed that was just too hot to handle. He's made it two, and no doubt he's hungry for more. Juventus, two up and into a position of real strength. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them, and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Out to the right. Dybala. Now it's Morata. And the weighted pass. Yet another to add to football's endless list of could-haves and should-haves. Uh, that was just poor decision-making and a weak execution. Bastoni. He's come loose. Now it's Dybala. Towering header! Oh, just needed a better contact. Oh, that's a real disappointment as well, after he worked so hard to just get into position and get on the end of that in the first place. A lot of effort for very little reward. It's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. And it's Correa. And he's going long. Out for a throw. Barrera. Chalanolu. Comes under pressure, and it's come loose. Now it's Morata. And it's Dybala. Chiesa, and here's Dybala. Well read, he sorted that out. And that has been clubbed away. Chiesa, and here's Dybala. Out to the left it goes. A really good feat from him. Bernadeschi. 
That's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Brozovic drives it forward, breaks on here. He's through. That has put a stop to that. Chelhanolu, Correa, and here's Martinez. Chalanolu, Perisic, now it's Perisic. That's good defending, very good defending. Lucatelli has created one goal already. And it's Morata, Bernadeschi, chance to break. Morata, Morata opts to play it back. And that'll be the last act of the first half. Juventus are two up, and on the balance of things, I would say, deservedly so. They had a very coherent game plan, and if they are allowed to continue in the same vein, I can only see the margin getting bigger. Well, that has been a goal-blessed half. It is 3-1. And the game has already resumed here. Finds himself eased off the ball. Berdeski plays a clever pass. And it's hoisted clear. Hoists it forward. And it's Jekko. Martinez. It's a great ball, has a pop, no mistake, and the second half is off to a flyer. Yeah, the pass was bang on and he just had to ensure he didn't stray offside. The finish was actually bang on too. This is threatening to become a really good game. Well, I think they probably needed an early goal in this half just to give them the confidence and belief to push on and look for an equaliser. Chiesa, Bernadeschi. Good take and he's had a look. He's in space and looking for options. Berdeski, chance! It's in! A two-goal cushion, and it's looking safe! Oh, high-quality goal, lovely first touch, sumptuous second. So the lead now is two. Listen, it's up to them now how they think about it from here because... Well, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. make it a fresh attempt to release someone in behind from back to front and this is something different Berdeski Morata Chiesa oh that's a waste Perisic gets rid without sophistication 
Bentancur. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No. It's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind. And here's Morata. Just brushed off the ball there. Brozovic. Martinez. Uh, looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. And he's going to have his name taken. Well, sometimes a loose foul can trigger a completely different spell of play and uh, it makes even less sense. And it's Jekyll. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Get a throw in. But there's going to be another change here. Checo, and that's sprayed out wide. Well, that's a foul, and the whistle's gone. And no surprise, that's a booking. I do you think he's feeling the effects of that tackle? Off a fine save. Well, I thought a starting position was good, and that helped the keeper to judge the flight of the ball and, and deal with it well. And it's played forward. Oh, let down by a lack of accuracy. And for a moment, you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Into Milan, making another change here. To throw. Juventus making consecutive changes here. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real on a shift. Chiesa, Dybala, Chiesa, and it's Dybala. And here's Quadrado. Tibala! And a second time! And that would have been game set and match. Well, that ought to have wrapped it up, Peter. He may well regret that, you know. DeMarco. Now it's Dzeko. Oh, he's not going to get that. Bentancur looks to dink one in. Damian. Brozovic. Eriksson. Barrera. Chiellini positions himself well and cuts it out. Chiesa. He's got through. Damian does well to read it and intercepts. Brozovic, who has made his impact already. Eriksson. And it's Sanchez. Brozovic. Damian. 
Right through the middle. Oh, he's gone for it! De Ligt goes looking. De Marco gets it back. The referee's awarded a free kick. Pushes to get on the end of it. Kolachevsky gets away from his opponent. Room for a shot. Can he dig out a shot? Morata shoots! And more, and more, and more. And the lead is three. It is surely done. Lovely goal. Perfect poise to set himself for the strike. He's made it three, quite a day at the office for him. This is one of the best performances I've seen in a while. He's practically taken on this team single-handedly, and they don't know how to stop him. So now... And the referee brings it to a close. Juventus did it the hard way, a testament to their great powers of recovery. They have defied the odds. So there it is. What struck you most about that? Juventus made their intentions clear that nothing else but a win would do. These games are always tough, you know. 